for the next 30 days, I'm going to build an AI automation agency from complete scratch and take it to $10,000 in revenue, all while on vacation. And if I cannot do so, I'm going to pick someone from the comment section on this video and PayPal them $1,000. Now I need to prove to everyone that it wasn't just luck that I was able to build my own AI automation agency from zero to tens of thousands of dollars per month in revenue. So in order to prove this, I came up with a plan. So my plan is to follow these three rules. Rule number one is that everything I do must be completely separate from my agency Morningside AI. This means a new name, a new site, and definitely no testimonials to start with. The offer that I do show to the prospect will need to be shown without any previous client's work. Rule number two is that I can only use no-code and low-code platforms when in creating my deliverables. I cannot use my own development company to custom code things, I must do it myself. And rule number three is that I cannot run any kind of paid advertising in order to get clients, keeping my budget as close as possible to zero. So let's get started. Step number one, I need to get the foundations laid for my agency. This starts with niche selection. Now creating an AI automation agency is a unique opportunity right now because it is a new model within a relatively new industry which has advantages and disadvantages that we need to be aware of while selecting our niche. The advantage is that basically every industry right now is untapped, meaning there is opportunity wherever you look. So if you can find product market fit and create an offer around this in one of these untapped markets, then you will make a lot of money. However, the disadvantage is that because we are so early, we are only just starting to identify the proven offers that work within a given niche. So with this in mind, we are left with two options. Firstly, we can approach a completely unproven and untapped niche and we can find a partner within this industry to work with in order to identify the highest impact opportunities for AI integrations within the industry. And then we can create a, a package or an offer around what we get from that partnership. Essentially doing deep market research to figure out what the industry needs so that you can go on and sell that to others. Or secondly, we can go with one of the proven offers that have been already identified within the space and run with that. Considering I only have 30 days to make this work, I'm going to be going with one of the proven offers. From my recent work with my free incubator students called the Original 8, we have identified a huge need for appointment setting chatbots across various niches. In fact, one of the guys within the incubator, Isaiah, has actually signed a number of clients with his appointment setting chatbot offer in the past few weeks. Therefore, within this challenge, I will be creating an appointment setting chatbot agency initially focused on personal trainers. Now, the reason why I've chosen personal trainers as my niche is because they deal heavily with qualifying potential clients before they get on calls with them, so they can benefit hugely from an AI appointment setup. And I've also checked this niche against my niche selection criteria and it's passed with flying colors, so we're good to go here. Now, if you want a nitty gritty breakdown of my process for starting an agency, including things like my niche selection criteria, I actually have a two hour long beginner's guide video. So if you haven't watched that and you want to see the whole process that I'm doing within this video, uh, be sure to go and watch that and we'll give you all of the information you need. Now with my niche and my deliverable locked in, I'm ready to start step number two, offer creation. Now this stage in particular is absolutely crucial to the success of this challenge. I'm actually in Croatia on my vacation right now. So not wanting to waste a day cooped up inside, I headed down to the waterfront. Um, and I took with me my laptop, my notebook, and of course the essential resource, $100 million offers by Alex Amozi. I found a nice restaurant to post up at and locked out a huge offer planning workshop for the specific challenge. Now, the way I usually start this offer creation process is to identify, as Alex says, the dream outcome for the client. And for our niche personal trainers, I figured this would be something along the lines of to become one of the top trainers in the world with thousands of successful clients and have a huge following. Now with that dream outcome identified, my next job was to highlight how an effective appointment setting system is a significant, if not the most significant factor in them achieving this dream outcome. Next, I needed to drill down to the pain points that personal trainers are experiencing with their own appointment setting systems that currently use real people. And then finally, with all of this set up out of the way, I can present my chatbots as the solution. And to do this, I used Tomozzi's problem to solution system and then bundled these all together and then added the secret source of guarantees and scarcity, et cetera. And the result was three potentially grand slam offers that I can start testing in the real world. Now the three different offers that I've come up with are really just different takes on the pricing structure for the core deliverables here on screen. I'm gonna rattle through this pretty quickly, so feel free to pause it. These are the core deliverables, but then we also have bonus deliverables as well, which are really going to be used to push urgency so that people can act uh, when I ask them to. Now, these are just some of the bonus deliverables that came out of my offer workshop. I mean, all of these are rolled into three different pricing takes really. So firstly, we have commission-based, it's a free setup, and then I'm going to be taking 4% of all the deals that are closed. That's sort of industry standard for appointment setters is around five to 7%. So I'm kind of undercutting that with this 4%. 
I think some urgency and scarcity as well. Then secondly, we have a retainer based offer, which is going to be a free setup and then $2,500 per month after that. Then finally, we have our third offer, which is an upfront fee plus a completion fee and then also done a usage base beyond that. So we have $2,000 upfront, $1,500 upon completion, upon delivery of the system. And then we also we have a $1 per message sent. Now this is kind of variable, it can change around. It could be a $1 or $3 per message sent. It could be a $20 per call book, but basically it's going to be done on usage. And these are the different with pricing these different offers. So it's the same underlying deliverables and then the bonuses that I'm sprinkling in, but there's three different takes on how I can actually price it. So these are all going to be worth testing in the near future. If you want to get access to all of the bonus deliverables that I've come up with, plus things like the guarantees and I'm using, et cetera, it's all going to be available in the first link in the description. So you can head down there and get access to that. Now tomorrow, my friends that I'm going to be spending the next two weeks with are actually arriving here in Split in Croatia with me. So they're all business owners. And I thought who better to test these offers on uh, than a bunch of business owners like them. So let's see what they think about the offers for my new AI automation agency. All right, we got Lance here. Um, we're gonna push them the AI appointments to the agency that I'm starting. So the idea is that you can get wherever you get your leads in, you can then start a conversation by SMS or Instagram, DM, whatever it's going to be. I'm going to be doing personal trainers, but the idea is that I can do it on a commission basis. So it's 3% fee for any course book, get anything that closes. Um, or you can do it a retainer with a staff proper fee. So I know you guys have all sorts of things. I want to get your thoughts on it while we have uh, Lance here. No, I think it's a great idea. I have an education company and an e-commerce fund, so I would definitely use it for everything follow-up wise. So these are first clients. No, he's like actually guys. done. Yeah. No, it's good for me as well because I uh, I run an influencer marketing business, and one of the main things that we do is influencer outreach, and primarily it comes through like qualifying them, qualify them and stuff, and then also going via yeah. like Instagram DMs and stuff. But the follow up process with Instagram DMs is awful because we yeah. can't set up sequences and whatnot, so it's it save a lot of uh, time consumes on that. Right. Well, Mr. Sales over here. So yeah, do it to do it. No, no, dude, that that'd be so clutch because I I was gonna hire a was it VA. Yeah, what you said is run through like, like underwear, man. That's what we keep going from the like, work we're talking to about. Yeah, yeah. That, like the, the turnover for these guys is so high. Um, yeah, Johnny, what are you going? With? I'm with these guys. I'm in the influencer marketing space as well, and it's just a no-brainer. Just yeah. perfect. Easy game. Well, thanks, Lance. That's the soundboard. I think we're good to move forward and, uh, and start running this. Now we're back just a few days later. I've finished off my trip in Croatia, which was an absolute blast. Uh, we're now here in Phuket in Thailand. Uh, we're here for the next month. And while I was on my sale week, the first thing I did was decide on a domain. Uh, this is sort of the business setup of what we're going to be doing. Now I looked around on GoDaddy for a couple of different ones and I did settle on a cool one that I really, really think fits this, this business and this challenge well. What we're going to be running with is setwithai.com. So as in setyourcallswithai.com, which I think is a pretty cool and brandable name. So I secured that in GoDaddy and then I took that over to ClickFunnels and I wanted to build out at least a basic landing page. I know I, I tell you guys not to do this, but I think for the purpose of this, because I already have an offer that I'm going to be running and I've decided on it, I do have the time to set up a, a landing page for it as well. So I went on to ClickFunnels, I set up a basic landing page, which you're going to be able to be, be seeing on screen now. There'll also be a link in the description for you to check out what I did, but very basic, just a headline calling out the avatar. I've got a little video of myself that I just shot before here. So that didn't take me long at all, maybe a couple of hours. But the key thing here is that the landing page didn't take long because I did all the hard work when it came to offer creation. So I actually did a ton of work on the offer creation side of things, as you may have seen earlier, but I do have an enormous document showing you the exact steps that I took as sort of a, a visual breakdown and sort of brain dump of all the different stages I took following Homozzi's blueprint, of course. So if you want to get access to that, I'm going to be making it available to my uh, AAA Accelerator community. So if you're not already in there, we are in a wait list currently. We've sold out of the wait list and I think two minutes, the 150 spots was gone. So uh, we are going to be opening that up in the near future. So if you are interested in joining my AAA Accelerator, where we have coaches teaching you everything you need to know, you have people you can talk to. We have really experts in there that I'm handpicking and we have free workshops a week in there as well. So people are really, really loving that. And I'd only be happy opening up to more people if the reception was good, which it has been amazing. And you guys have seen firsthand the kind of value that I'm willing to give away for free for the for the benefit of all of you. You can be damn sure that when I'm taking your hard earned dollars, I'm doing everything I possibly can to make sure you guys are getting a huge ROI on that. As we've seen with some of the results that have been coming out of the community and already in the past week since it's launched. So I'll put a couple of those up on here, but I'm really, really excited because we also have another massive announcement to do with my community and that we have secured the big man 
Alex from Aussie to come into our Discord and do a one hour workshop with all of us. Now, you guys may have seen on my newsletter or my community or even here on the YouTube uh, community post that we were trying to get signups to his uh, $100 million leads event. And we were able to be in the top 10 of all the people who were referring. So we were able to secure a one hour workshop with them. Now, if you want to be part of the workshop and you want to have a Ask questions to Alex Mozzi himself. There's a link to sign up to the Accelerator. We're going to be taking questions from the Accelerator, but there's going to be a recording available to the community as well. So I'm so, so excited to that. And I want to do a big thank you and a huge shout out to everyone who signed up to that. I honestly, from the bottom of my heart, I appreciate that so much. And I'll be doing everything I can to continue to give value here to all of you because this is the sort of reciprocal relationship that we have there. And I really, really appreciate every one of you who signed up and made this possible. So if you're excited for that and you want to be a part of it, you can sign up in the description below. In terms of this challenge, the next episode is going to be showing me signing my first client. So I'm going to be taking that landing page and going to be taking the domain and everything. And you're going to be seeing all of the processes that I'm doing, the outbound through LinkedIn, through Instagram, through cold email, my cold calls. Everything is going to be in the next video showing you step by step the process I'm taking. So if you're as excited as I am about this 0 to 10k challenge, be sure to head down below and subscribe to the channel. Hit the bell so you're notified when the next one drops. And leave a like on the video if you've enjoyed. It would mean the world to me. It helps more people see this. Helps more people to get into the AI automation agency space. And while you're down there, leave a comment. I'm going to be giving away a 20-minute 20, uh, 20 consulting call, as I always do, um, to someone who comments. So if you want to win a consulting call with me and have a chat about your business, about your AI automation agency, just leave a comment down below and hopefully you'll be winning. That's all for part one of the series. I obviously have a ton of work to be doing, but I will see you in the next one when I've signed my first clients. I'm going to show you exactly how I did it.